there is a new search in the case of a missing Massachusetts woman. Maura Murray vanished in February of 20 or 2004. WBZ's Paula Evan is here with us tonight. And Paula, investigators say that there's nothing specific which prompted this new search. No, David, they tell us today's efforts are just part of the ongoing investigative process. 18 years ago, the 21-year-old UMass Amherst student left campus and got into a crash on Route 112 in Haverhill, New Hampshire. At the time, a witness told police they had spoken with Murray, but by the time emergency crews arrived, she was gone. There have been several searches in the area in the years since, but nothing's ever been found. Today, I spoke with Maura's sister about this new effort to find answers. I'm a little overwhelmed with emotions right now because um, it's not every day that I get a call like this, that there's an active ground search. Um, I, it's very encouraging. Um, I'm, I'm hopeful. Um, I'm pleased to know that the search is still active 18 years later. Um, but again, it, it always, it, it brings a flood of different emotions every time I get that call. Of course. Of course. So tell us, th there's no new information per se in the case, but they've decided to search an area uh, to a greater extent than they have before? Right. Um, they decided to search an area that was actually a focal point of a very early search. So in May of 2004, this particular area was searched, um, and that was based on a, a tip that they, uh, law enforcement was provided. And this area is only about five miles from where Mora's car was found. Um, and it's at the intersection of two sort of main, main major roads. So, um, you know, I'm hopeful that, that we find something. And Julie says the family is in constant contact with police, which gives them so much hope that one day Mora's case will be solved. David and Lisa? It is a long time to live with that uncertainty, Paula. Thank you.